Hey guys, my name is Overpowered, and in today's video, weapons that are going to be coming up with them. Right. But before we do, make sure to like, subscribe, turn on those notifications. So let's get into it. With these new weapons coming with them. Witch Queen, these are the weapons that are becoming in the way. Got the four Warrant, Nightmare, and Con Paz. And there's this um desperate es essence or some type of essence um that's up there that um with crafting can be very very useful for maybe if you wanted to I don't know like craft a um like that AR um kind of boost up its stats by range impact or something within the crafting system and we already know that the crafting system is going to be on Mars so Mars is going to be a sort of a helm that's what it's going to kind of be like and the crafting system is going to be kind of like what we have today in the helm and then turn in your main grounds so with that we probably will have to go to there quite often to complete those challenges. We've seen quite a few challenges down there that we are probably going to have to complete to be able to get that utter god roll. And to get the god roll, you would think that with the SMG, you would probably want like hip fire grip with like a PvP god roll. You want maybe kill wind, killing wind with like kill clip or something. Um that could be possible within the witch queen uh, and there's, there's supposedly gonna be two extra mods on the right slot uh have to see within the witch queen which out 16 18 days and within the witch queen you're gonna probably find quite a few exotics that you're probably want to get your hands on like the glaive with for the warlock is going to be very helpful it's going to be kind of like the well grenade or well you do you can throw a or the boots of the assembler you probably the assembler is i will make a in-depth guide on what that is and how to use it but with that out the way let's talk about what these weapons are gonna do like let's start off with the titan glaive titan glaive will Obviously, be yeah, very good, overpowered. Point. I have seen you come back from Titan Glaive is gonna see. spawn a bubble. Okay, let's uh, just imagine you putting down a bubble, a circle, taking, putting that circle, giving you what, kind of like how you have a well or a bubble. Day. you put down that bubble it'll give you let's hope it gives you like extra attack or extra defense something okay so with that um we're gonna move on from there to the warlock so with the warlock one let's see here that it could probably be one of the best if not the best because you throw down your um little circle thing and that will give you a um health maybe that could be a health thing because with the boots of assembler it does give you orbs that you can uh they'll uh, um bring to you and then heal you so that is a possibility um that will be good for mobility and also not having to carry uh, the boots of the assembler every single match of every single run in a raid or something like that in the future raids. So with um that, we're moving on from the hunter. With the hunter, it shoots electricity off of the ground. So imagine the middle tree or one of the trees, like top tree, bottom tree, or middle tree, um, shooting up electricity from the ground. That's what's gonna happen. It's gonna probably do like AOE damage, hopefully, that explodes nearby enemies because it's arc. Obviously, we're gonna be probably seeing that. Maybe. Um, and within having to put. Uh, 
exotics, like, I'll discuss the exotics in another video, but those are kind of insane. Going from uh, coming from there, we are gonna probably go from that to uh, how the um how the crafting system will work. Hopefully there will be a mod. A mod and a mod and so different types of sets. So if we if you guys do like get like a mod, like a if you guys don't like killing wind on a PvE god roll you're searching for, then that could be let's hope easily arranged. But we're not to see within the Witch Queen, I'm not gonna say for sure. But, um, from there, um, Witch Queen, or start grinding bounties. Now, I got stacks of bounties, uh, ready for the Witch Queen. You can, I'll make an in-depth guide on how to complete them, where to complete them, and what's the best farm for those. Sure. Uh, once I make that video on it. So, make sure, that's why you guys make sure to subscribe for videos like But, without that uh, um so let's get right back to the to um the info so with the um witch queen information um probably gonna be quite easy or hard depending on how hard the enemies are gonna be within grandmasters those are gonna be deadly because we got the revive we got the revive we got everything that's gonna probably mess you up you don't want to mess up within a grandmaster you have to re um, go back to orbit after your teammates die so make sure if you do kill them this is for february 4th if you do watch this in a later time then make sure i tell you make sure that you have like discipline or uh, resilience and recovery that's gonna probably just be the meta right there because you're gonna be shot by supers other stuff like that with thralls and other stuff i don't think there shouldn't be too much taken people are yeah so taken is not gonna be an issue um from there we are gonna talk about the reason that um you will probably see more artifacts in the future of titan uh, so with Titan, or not for Titan, but Stasis in general. So if you guys seen the trailer, um, the recent trailer, the Titan shoves a barricade, like a barricade. Then with the barricade, just shoots Stasis out of his hands. I will put in the description where you guys can possibly get or find that video i'll put it in the description below um so yeah that will probably be insane because you if there are enemies coming here toward you toward you you want to just pop throw down your shield easy you got that insta freeze you get that kill in pvp you're gonna be probably deadly you're gonna be most likely deadly with the stasis with its multiple buffs for Titan, this is probably going to be a relief for a lot of people. I wouldn't see why they would want to take those away or nerf those because they haven't nerfed the machine gun or the stasis machine gun that has been overpowered since last season, which <laughs> I can't blame them that I've been using in the past as well. Um, for next season's artifacts, I will be putting another um video out about how to get um certain weapons and up to the witch queen but if you guys did enjoy i will um, um if you guys did enjoy make sure to like subscribe turn on those notifications and i'll see you guys in the next one tomorrow at 2 p.m live stream maybe class see you guardians Bye.